The World Cup has the power to catapult a player from relative obscurity into the hearts and minds of football supporters across the globe. With the tournament now in its final week, any contribution made might become an iconic image in the history of the sport. No pressure, but one man who has taken his opportunity and run with it is Enzo Fernandez. He had only made three appearances for Argentina prior to the 2022 World Cup, all of them from the bench. The 21 years old was fulfilling a similar substitute role in Qatar at first, but then scored a fine goal in his country's second match, a 2-0 win over Mexico. Fernandez started the next game against Poland, assisted the goal for Julian Alvarez and has been in the side since. He is now being strongly linked with the move to Liverpool. In fairness, the rumors had already started before the World Cup got underway, however, the speculation has ramped up with reports emerging from South America that a pre-agreement for a deal next summer is now in place. Whether there's any truth in the stories will become apparent in due course. Fernandez only joined Benfica from River Plate last summer and will be under contract for another four years after this season, which suggests an imminent deal is unlikely. We shall see what unfolds, though he's certainly a fine player. Despite having arrived in Europe at the start of 2022-2023, Fernandez's numbers already suggest he has outgrown second-tier competitions. England, France, Germany, Italy, and Spain are considered the top five leagues. FB Ref then has the next eight, which includes the likes of the Eredivisie, MLS, the English Championship, and Portugal's Premier La Liga. On his FB Ref scouting report, Fernandez is in the top 1% of midfielders in the next eight competitions for the 23 different metrics, and the top 5% for a further 12. It's his pacing which stands out most, as well as an ability to find space in key areas. Close till I get up Time is barely on our side